Hello, it's Jason from digino.org and Data ABC. And today's video, I'm going to show you how to set up ManyCam in Data Class. Because, you know, I get this question a lot. Uh, it's quite tricky when you first start with ManyCam and you're thinking, right, how do I get this in my classroom? How does it work? Well, I'll show you right now. It's nice and easy. So, what you want to do is make sure you have ManyCam open before you go into data class. Um, yeah, it doesn't work very well if you don't have it open first. And you want to set up, or sorry, you want to book an empty classroom. And you just do this by contacting your coordinator through WeChat. And you can then book an empty classroom or you can book a session with IT. If you're not too confident with IT, an IT guy or gal will help you out. And yeah, they'll help you set it up. But what I'll do now is I'll cut to a video of me in an empty, let's move this cursor, me in an empty classroom and how you exactly set it up. So see you in a second. Okay, so what you want to do is go to the setting underneath the, uh, underneath your camera. Go to camera, it's not showing anything right now. All you want to do is set that to Medicam or whatever, you know, Medicam camera and set that to ManyCam internal microphone and then click OK. Oh, I don't know why it's not showing it now, but I'll show business for you. OK, there you go. Back to the classroom. All right, hopefully that's uh, been helpful. And, you know, it's fairly straightforward. And, you know, obviously, if you're not confident, ask me for help. I'm always here and IT should be able to help you just as much and yeah so like yep yeah, I hopefully hopefully that has got things running smoothly for you and now you can enjoy all the wonderful tips and tricks of ManyCam of how to actually use it now it's ready to be used so yeah check out all my other videos and digino.org for ways that you can use ManyCam and I'm always here to help see you next time bye bye